Hey, hey, family, this is Dr. LaDre Weathers with your Better Life Coach coming to you with today's Better Life Blurb. And if you've been paying attention, which I hope you have, we've been talking a lot about wealth. We've been talking a lot about finances because uh, money is an answer to so many things and it gives you so many choices. So we want to make sure that everybody, especially the first generation, high income earners have the chance to learn about wealth and money so they don't repeat their family and their community's mistakes. Right. Uh, before we get started, I want to make sure that you're aware that on December the 28th here in Atlanta, Georgia, uh, we're going to put on the Better Life Business Owner and Entrepreneurship Intensive. Hey, if you're a person who's looking to start a business, already have a business, or you're looking to greatly expand and increase the profitability of your business, you want to be in the room. Number one, the information is going to be so phenomenal. Uh, but number two, you're going to meet people just like you who want to make sure that business happens and it happens with excellence, but it's highly profitable. What's the point of being in business if you're not making money? And then number three, uh, yeah. You get a chance to make some connections and grow your business right there in the room. And then on uh, January the 17th through the 19th, we're going to do uh, the Better Life Retreat Weekend here in Atlanta. It's our very first one. Uh, so come on out and make history with us. Um, I know it's going to be a powerful event because I'm still putting together the agenda and solidifying all of our speakers. I promise you, I promise you, I promise you, uh, if you want 2020 to be an exponentially record-breaking year, you want to start it off in that environment so you have people just like you that can push you forward. We'll stop there with that. I don't want to take up too much time. Uh, we want to get to uh, wealth cycle number one. Got new content for you from uh, My Wealth Mentor, and I'm sharing it with you because it was good to me. Wealth cycle number one. Wealth cycle number one. And before I get into the cycles, please remember that the wealth cycles are not frozen blocks of time. You know, it's not like a calendar year. No, these are fluid they blend they bleed they merge they come back again on a higher level uh, my wealth my, my rich dad uh, my, my wealth dad um, whom i love much mr darnell self he says it this way i find that my lows are equal to my old highs <laughs> and what you'll find is that if you're at this stage you it'll come back again at this stage and when you're at this stage, it'll come back again at this stage. And it's always progressive and evolving. That's why we must consistently learn, keep learning, and relearn. Okay? Uh, wealth stage number one is the gathering stage. This is where you are gathering income and you're learning how to create wealth. You're learning how to manage money. You're learning how to master money. You're learning how to get your credit together. You're learning how to leverage credit. Gathering stage is where most people mess up because they never excel through the first round of the gathering stage. It's like trying to build a house without a foundation. With a small or an inadequate gathering foundation, you cannot build wealth because you have nothing to build with. It's the foundation. So think of the squirrels. You know, I pay attention to nature and it's somewhere around uh, October, September, October, here in Atlanta, the squirrels are gathering nuts. And the crazy part is they're gathering nuts not because they're hungry. They're gathering nuts not because uh, there's nothing else to do. They're not even gathering nuts to show off to their squirrel friends. I got all of these nuts. No, the squirrel is gathering nuts for one reason and one reason only. He or she knows that when everything goes into dormancy, they still got to eat. He or she knows that when uh, the, the, the baby squirrels come, they got to eat. He, they know that there will no longer be food available readily. So they've got to be ready for that. And too many of us humans are not functioning in the gathering phase. You know, when we had the shutdown some year, uh, a little over a year ago, I was hurt in my heart that so many families were struggling from missing one check by one day. So many families were about to lose everything because they lost two paychecks. That's because they failed in the gathering stage. And if you fail in the gathering stage, there can be no wealth to do the other things with. There can be no wealth to leave the legacy with. There can be no wealth Wealth to transform your community. There can be no wealth to take care of your family. There can be no wealth to fund the ministry. There can be no wealth to give to charity. There is no wealth and no resources because you have failed 
together. And what really grinds my gears is that so many people are in the stage of life where they should gather the most and they're playing the most. They're distracted the most. They're caught off guard the most. They're living the ignorance is bliss life the most when they should be gathering. It reminds me of all of the fairy tales that we grew up listening to. Well, when the wolf came, it was too late to get ready. When trouble came, it was too late to go hide. It was too late to go find it. You had to have it with you. But that only happens if you effectively, if you efficiently, and if you quickly master the gathering phase. And what I want you to do, look above or beneath this video. If you know you need some help mastering the gathering phase. Hey, I have coaches uh, because I'm still mastering the gathering phase at a higher level. If you know you've not started, if you know you've been procrastinating, if you know you've been getting away from the gathering stage, hey, do, the, do this favor for yourself. Click the link above or beneath. Look, click, give us your very best email. Watch the link because it gives you strategies to help you in the gathering phase. But I'm also going to encourage you to create to gather up to create a call so that we can talk. I want to give you some extra help and maybe just maybe we can lock arms for a period of about 12 weeks and I can really push you in the gathering stage because that's what you need to master so that when it happens, depression, recession, job loss, whatever it is, you're ready because you've mastered the gathering stage. Hey, remember that when life is pretty good, a better life is always best. Blessings to you. We'll talk soon. I'll see you in the next video.